Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. In today's lecture, I'm going to show you how to install Ruby programming language on your Mac OS. First of all, let me tell you something about the Ruby programming language. So Ruby is an interpreted high level general purpose programming language which supports multiple programming paradigms. It was designed with an emphasis on programming productivity and simplicity. In Ruby, everything is an object including primitive data types. It was developed in mid 1990s in Japan. So Ruby is dynamically typed and uses garbage collection and just in time compilation. It supports multiple programming paradigms including procedural object oriented and functional programming according to its creator ruby was influenced by perl smalltalk eiffel ada basic java and lisp now let's move on to the installation so there are a lot of ways to install ruby so first let us check the initial or the original website so let me just search ruby so here is the original website or the official website and let's move on to downloads so there are a lot of ways of installing rubies so these are for different systems but today we are going to install ruby using homebrew so we'll just go to homebrew and we have to search for ruby if you don't have homebrew installed please refer to our video on homebrew installation on your mac and then search ruby so this is the official command and i'm going to paste it in my terminal and hit enter So it is running a brew update it always does this whenever you use homebrew for installing anything so it has been updated and it says we have 11 outdated formula that have been installed and it also says that ruby 3.2.1 is already installed and up to date let's just reinstall so that you can see it in action brew installed ruby so since it's already installed so i don't need to install it again but in order to show you what is the whole process i'm just reinstalling it so this is the whole process behind the installation So a lot of dependencies directories will be installed there will be connections background processes that will go on I think the installation is complete. Let me just confirm. Yeah, it's already installed and up to date. So in today's video, we covered how to install Ruby programming language on your Mac OS. That will be all for today. Thank you.